In this snip, we'll be adding a Hyper-V host to our Veeam Backup and Replication inventory using PowerShell. I've already got my Veeam PowerShell session running, and I'll start by specifying the credentials that will be used to connect to my Hyper-V host. I'll do this using the get credential commandlet, specifying the username and password. Then I'll add the host using add VBR Hyper-V host, specifying the name. This could be the DNS name or a IP address. You can give the host a description. If you don't give a description, Veeam will auto-generate one stating when it was added and who it was added by. And then you can provide the credentials we created in the previous step. After a moment, you'll see the running maintenance job that's adding the server to your inventory. If any packages need to be deployed to the host, this will happen automatically using the credentials you've provided. And then when the job completes, you'll see information about the Hyper-V server that you just added to your inventory. That's been adding a Hyper-V host to your Veeam backup and replication inventory. Thank you for watching.